it's Brittany. So today, um, today's gonna be a back in time watches video, and today I'll be looking back on the first time I've watched Jaws, and well, I didn't really grow up watching it. Um, quite little, and I think that's only because. I think if I had seen it at that time, it would have really scared me. But even before I saw Jaws, um, I had a fear of sharks by then, you know. Even when I was quite little, I had a fear of sharks and only because at the time there were, um, we had a lot of, um, National Geographic magazines um, that were coming in in the mail and one of them was about sharks and on the front cover showed like a big picture of a great white shark and I still remember this picture of what it looked like even though it's been years since I've seen this magazine um, but on the cover of the magazine shows a great white shark and is out of the water like this and it's this had his mouth wide open so so okay so I, for those who have the magazine or have seen it before or the picture itself on there you probably know what I'm talking about where it's like this and you see the mouth wide open from like the front here and you kind of see the the side of it and you kind of like see the water that like going into its mouth and I remember every time I saw that I would just get so scared looking at it so it's like every time I see it I was just like when I would see it I'm like okay no and yeah there's times where I'm looking through the magazines and when I would pick it up I'll I would just put it down right away I'm like mm, okay no and I was just get away so so I had a fear of sharks because of that, because of the National, National Geographic magazine that was about sharks and because of that cover that I still remember was just like, oh, it's, it's scary to look at. So, so I remember when I did first watch, yeah, when I first saw Jaws, I was... I'm trying to think. I think I was 14. Yeah, I was 14 when I first saw Jaws. And, um, it scared me. Now, I, I remember watching it because I thought, well, it's directed by Steven Spielberg. And I thought, well, what could go wrong? You know? Oh, okay, I'm back. Sorry about that. Um, so, yeah, that's what I thought because I thought, well, this is directed by Steven Spielberg and I thought, you know, he's a really great director and one of my favorites, so I thought, I, I want to see it, you know, just to see how it is. And I remember, <laughs> sorry, I have these little bugs in my room and they're just kind of irritating me so sorry about that I'll I'll just ignore them so anyway um like that I think I was probably 14 when I first saw Jaws and I was like and so yeah I don't know to me it's just I was just quite surprised that um that this movie is about a shark you know like a shark movie so I thought okay um and yeah i was just curious because i wasn't sure how it was gonna go but when i did first watch it oh man i was scared i'm not kidding i was scared because there are certain parts where um where you know where you hear the music i'm like uh oh like Oh no, it's coming. So I think that's what made it scary was the ominous music score for Jaws. And I think John Williams did a great job 
still composing the music for it because like I don't know how to describe it but yes the, the only thing I can describe that is very ominous very and and then even though those scenes for the shark you know moving and and then at times when it was you know attacking and killing people it's like oh gosh this is horrible and what I feel bad for is that I feel for the I feel bad for the sheriff because you know he's the one who was trying to close down the beach and the mayor tells him no because they're going to be losing money because I think it was getting close to the 4th of July and so it's like he didn't want to be losing that money since he knew that he was going to make a lot more money um, because of the 4th of July it's like you are so greedy you don't care about you know these people's you know well, the people's safety like so yeah it's like come on you know I don't know but I think if I were in charge I would still close down the beach if there was a shark, to, shark attack only because if there were continuous you know shark attacks going on and it just wouldn't stop then yeah I would close in even if I had to lose money in the process it's like so what at least people's life would would be um, spared and at least they would be safe and and knowing that would not happen I'm sorry there's one flying around near my lamp would you stop okay I don't like these bugs they're kind of small but they're just irritating anyway so, yeah, I, I just don't like the mayor only because he just seems very, you know, greedy and he doesn't take any responsibility for his actions and he just cares about making money when people go to the beach and he doesn't care, um, he doesn't care if, if anyone's out there and to him it's like, okay, well, if there's a shark attack going on then I, I don't know like it to me it just seems like he's not thinking like seems like he's to me he seems like he's a scarecrow where he doesn't have a brain <laughs> I, I, I'm sorry but I, that's just what it seems like to me even in part two like very irresponsible and so I do feel bad for the sheriff's head because when he tried to close down the beach and the mother who lost her young son, um, you know, to the shark, she slaps him and, you know, it's not his fault, but, you know, I think what she should have done is that if she had known that it was the mayor's fault for not closing down the beach and that's why her son got attacked and got killed by the shark was because the mayor did not take any responsibility responsibility at all to close down the beach and I think if she had known that instead she could have slapped the she could have slapped the mayor on the face so I think that probably would have been better <laughs> well at least for her because you know she was grieving so I think uh, I wouldn't have mind if I saw her slapped the mayor on the face like you know because I think he deserved it so, yeah, so there are some parts in the movie where I'm like, okay, wh what is going on? And even for those that would go in the water and they think, um, you know, they could just go out there and have fun, I'm like, no, like, don't go out there, like, get out. And even, like, when the shark is coming, you know, I, I'm, like, scared and I'm thinking, like, come on, like, get out, <laughs> you know? And, and uh, you know that's the one thing I would never do like even if I was at the beach I would never ever 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 go on the water 
only because of my fear of sharks and you know because I wouldn't want I wouldn't want anything else to like to pull me from underneath like to somehow drag me and it drowns me in the water or if something were to you know because with sharks they're fishes and they just um rip things apart you know they do and it's so horrible and no one wants to die like that so yeah and like I said there's just something about sharks that really sets me off you know that really really makes me feel afraid of them not just because well of everything like the way they kill and and all that so I think you can say um even watching this movie made me feel like um like that even while watching this movie I thought you know I'm so glad that I never gotten out in the water on the beach because because something like that could have happened where it could have been the shark's meal and you know I'm like uh no one wants to be that and so um but I would say this now there are some parts that I like where you know he's trying to close down the beach but the mayor doesn't listen and I I do like how the the three main characters are trying to like somehow they kind of team up and they talk about what they need to do to take down you know the shark so that way it would just stop terrorizing people in the water you know and so yeah I just like how that they're like trying to come up with a plan like how to kill it but um uh, I what I also didn't like about Jaws was um, the fact that like oh I did not like this part I know may, there there might be some who love this part but I don't because it just scares me but there's a certain part where you know where all of them like are on the boat and at some point um, the shark comes up from the water and you see the mouth roll up close like that and it's kind of moving if you know what I mean like that part specifically where it just shows the mouth like oh I, I still remember that part exactly how it plays out and I'm like oh no I don't like looking into the mouth it's like I don't know it's just so uneasy it's just scary to look at like oh no no thank you and so I remember during that part, um, I remember I was so scared. I screamed and I jumped back. I'm like, I'm like this, you know. So I was like that the first time watching it, and and so yeah, I also remember being so scared. I remember being further away from the TV. I'm like, oh, like, oh, <laughs> and my eyes twitching. <laughs> So that's how I felt. I think that's how I still feel about it. But it's been a while since I've seen the first. But I did recently saw um, Jaws 2. So if you guys want to know how I saw that, I will mention it. So yeah, I will. Um, so I'll just say this. And, you know, it is a good movie. I mean, you know, I like it. Although it's not my favorite, so it's like, uh, I kind of feel like I just need something to cover my eyes with, you know? <sighs> so yeah, that's how I felt. I felt completely scared. And I think the one part Oh, I didn't like this part either. It's a part where the the character of Quint, I believe, where where at some point this shark he, the the shark is like getting you know aggressive and yet it put its weight onto the boat 
and this so it's like the bow's lifting up like this because the shark's right here and it's and it kills the character but at the same time you kind of see this um camera angle where you see the shark moving like this with his mouth open it's like uh like okay i can't look at that that's just uh that's just scary like no no thank you and so i didn't like how that character got killed because it's like this you know right onto his legs and it just pulls him into the water and it kills the character and kills him like that i didn't like that because like he was one of the good characters you know he was with these guys and you know he's you know you know like he was on the boat and he was you know safe for at least for a moment but then when that happened it's like it's kind of like since he knew about sharks that he just got killed off like that and it, and it's like why so yeah i don't like how he got killed like that it's almost like it's almost like watching like um like a vicious killer you know um killing someone to death you know, it was almost like that, but in this way, more like not a human being killing him, but more like of a shark doing that, but almost, almost like killing him like in a cold-blooded way, you know, like a killer shark. So it's like, <sighs> so yeah, I felt bad when his character got killed off, but the other two stayed alive. So that was like okay good um but i think the part i do like though is where um the sheriff he's really trying to to really kill the shark and he's just really trying to focus on like i think his movements and because i remember he put something in his mouth it was a a tank like some kind of a explosive tank and you know into his mouth and I think he had a gun with him so at some point I think when the shark opens his mouth a little bit he shot right into it and all of a sudden this big explosion and there's shark pieces shark guts everywhere now do I feel bad that the shark was blowing up to pieces no <laughs> And I'm sorry, like, I know there are those who love sharks and love shark movies, but I'm not a fan of shark movies. I mean, I will watch a shark movie, maybe just to see what it's about and see what happens. But other than that, like, I just get scared watching it and, you know, they scare me. So it's like, you know, I like that I don't really love it but like I said so I think with Jaws like that I like it it, it is a good movie but <laughs> it's just not something I would watch often because I would feel like whenever there would be those parts of the shark coming and especially it has those parts where the it comes out of the water and you see its mouth open like gah I feel like because of those parts and because how it's just scary um in some ways um yeah that's why i would not watch it often but i think if i were to watch it i would want to watch it with a friend only because if i were to watch it by myself like completely by myself i don't think i would handle it but if i watched it with a friend then yeah i i would i, I think i would still be okay I will still be scared, but knowing if I have a friend with me watching it, it's like, okay, at least, you know, even though I'm scared, but at the same time, at least I have a friend watching it with me, so, you know, it, it's all good. <laughs> so, yeah, and I think I said the impression that Jaws left on me was never, never, ever, ever, ever go on the water because something like this could happen if it does that shark could 
you know, could take your life away. And it's like, you don't want that. So, mm -hmm. and, and the, the way it made me felt was, I think I probably felt more afraid of sharks because of the way they are and how they are like that where no matter what's in the water, whether if it's either a sea animal, you know, or, or even just a human being that's like, they don't care. They'll drag you and rip you apart and and to me they, they do seem like vicious, you know, um, killers um, in, in the water. And so it's like, uh, I would never want to come to face one. Although I've had nightmares about it, which is not good. But yeah, that's the impression it left on me is to never go on the water. Because you just don't know if that could happen. And you don't want that to happen to you. And how it made me feel was made me feel probably more scared of sharks and it's like, okay, um, nope. So yeah, because it made me feel probably more afraid of sharks, it's like, okay, it's a good thing <laughs> that I will never go on the water. But I would say other than that, like I said, Steven Spielberg did a great job directing this movie and despite the fact that it came out in 1975, I would say it it still did a good job, like portraying this um, movie, like killer shark movie, like you know, man versus creature movie. So I think it did very well, and yeah. So like I said, Steven Spielberg did a great job directing it, and the the way it turned out, which did scare a lot of people. Um, at the time when it came out, so it's like, when it did came out, it's like, they were afraid to go to the beach, and I don't blame them, because even though years have gone by now, it's like, even I would still be afraid to go out, you know, in, in the water, because it's like, I never want to have that kind of fate, you know, where, where I'm facing the shark, and it's like, oh no, this is it, this is, this is going to be over for me. Like, no, <laughs> no, with me, I would rather have the shark's life be, be gone, you know, and then I can continue to live my life, you know, so yeah, that's all I'm gonna say, but yeah, and, you know, and of course, John Williams, he did a good job composing the music for this movie, like, he did a really great job. And the cast, you know, they were great, and yeah, so, like I said, this is a good movie. Um, like, like that, in a way, I liked how it turned out, but at the same time, I'm, it's like, I'm not a fan of Jaws, but although I think it's so good, you know, so I like some things about it, but I just don't like the scary shark parts of it. it if that makes sense. So anyway, um, okay, so, um, yeah, hope you enjoyed this, and, uh, now, I, I'm pretty sure for a lot of people who have seen Jaws the first time that maybe they grew to love it, and it, it's like their favorite, and if it is, that's completely fine. But as for me, it's like, I didn't exactly love it the first time watching it because, you know, I was just scared. So it made me really scared, you know, of sharks. And I was just, but at the same time I thought, okay, this is good. Since we did a great job and I thought, okay, there's some things I do like about the movie, but I'm just scared of the scary, you know, shark parts, especially when it opens its mouth. And I don't quite get that. Like, I feel like when there are those parts when it opens his mouth, it's like, what are you trying to do? Like, 
Do you think you're so impressive because you have such a big jaw with teeth? Like, oh sure, that's very impressive. <laughs> so, um, yeah, I really hope you enjoyed this video and that was the first time I first saw Jaws. And um, I hope you enjoyed this and um, to see more movie content, um, please subscribe like the video and leave a comment down below on when you first saw Jaws and whether if you liked it or love it or not and what impression it left on you and are you a Jaws fan? So let me know in the comments below. That's all for today and I'll see you at the movies.